red with your blood and Rome is our goal. How do such vows of revenge come about, which are perhaps also followed by corresponding actions? Ohne das Wissen. Without knowledge of the teaching of reincarnation, which is also part of the original Christian's teachings, without the awareness that souls live eternally, and that after a life on earth, there is the possibility of reincarnation, that is, a new embodiment of the soul in the human body, what is taking place before our eyes today cannot be explained. The teaching of reincarnation also includes the law of cause and effect. Even Paul, who is so highly venerated by the church, said, Do not be deceived. God is not mocked. For whatever a man sows, that he will also reap. With the aid of historically confirmed facts, let us take a look at institutional Christendom's seed, whose harvest may be imminent or is even already underway. It is not by chance when young hate-filled zealots craving for revenge direct their declarations of war against Christianity as the crusaders of the Western world. Because all the cruel crimes of the institutional churches, very especially those of the Vatican, against the people and cultures of the Middle East, are, until today, not atoned for, just as those against other people